Okay, good morning, everyone. So today we are here to learn about our one of the primary utilization implement that is your MP plot. So we see the different parts and what are the functions of the MP plot. So as you know, I have told that the MP plot is the primary utilization implement which helps in the first opening of the soil. Okay. So this is your primary utilization implement. So what is the main function of the MP plot? Is that it helps in cutting, it helps in lifting, inverting the soil and pulverizing the soil. So these are the four functions which are done by the MB plow. So I will see in this video that how these four functions are done effectively by the MB plow. Cutting, lifting, turning and pulverizing. So I am going to tell you the different parts. <coughs> so MB plow has four parts. Basically the MDPLOW is divided into four parts. The first part is the sayer. So this you are seeing over here. This is known as the sayer. Okay. This is known as the sayer. This part is known as the curved part which you are seeing over here. The curved part is known as the mold board. Okay. And that is why the name of the plow is known as given as your mold board plow. Okay. Come to this side. If you see to this side, this side is known as the land side. Okay, this side is known as the land side, right? This side is this bar you are seeing over here. This bar is known as the land side, and the part you are seeing into his the things are bolted is known as the frog. Okay, so four parts basically. First is the mold board, then sayer. Okay, this point is the part of the sayer. And then this bar you are seeing, this is your land side and this is your frog. So this basically these are four parts and you can see one bar is attached to this MB plow. So to this bar actually all the parts are attached. So this part is known as the standard. Okay. So standard and these are the plow. Or you can say the bottom of the plow. And this is the three point linkage to which the tractor is attached. Okay. So as I have told you that this is the bottom link, these two are the bottom links and this is the top link. Okay. So to, to these three points your tractor is and the implement is hitched to the tractor. Okay. So let me tell you the different functions of the uh, MB plow. So first you can see this share. Okay. So share up to this point, up to this point, this part can be considered as the share. Okay. So function of the share is that it makes a horizontal cut below the surface. Okay, that means what? The soil, the sear is the part which actually penetrates into the ground and makes a horizontal cut below the surface. Like the, all the furrows which are made in the field, these are made by the sear. Okay. Then comes your MB plow. MB plow is mainly responsible for the turning, lifting and pulverizing of the soil. Okay. The sear cuts the soil and the MB plow helps in your turning, lifting and pulverizing the soil. How it is done again? See, when the soil will come, that means the sear, when the sear will cut the soil, the soil will come, okay? But that means the cutting is done, then the soil will lift over to the end plow, okay? So this portion is, I mean, this, to this portion, the soil will lift it to this portion, okay? Then you can see one curvature is there for the end plow, you can see this curvature, okay? So through this curvature, Cutting is done, I mean this cutting, then you are lifting, through this curvature your turning of soil is done. And after that, the soil falls on the ground and it pulverizes. So cutting, lifting, through this curvature the pulverization is done and finally the soil falls on the ground and the, uh, sorry, uh, and the pulverization is done. Okay. So cutting, lifting, turning is done, so this curvature is mainly meant for your turning and the pulverizing of the soil. So these are the four functions of your MB plow as I have told you. Now next comes to the land side. So this bar is known as the land side. What will happen when this furrow will be formed in this direction? Suppose this is the direction in which the furrow is formed. Okay. What the land side will do? Land side will take all the thrust from the furrow wall. Okay. Whatever thrust it will give from the furrow wall, all the thrust will be taken by your land side. That means what? This land side will run along with the wall of the furrow wall okay so that all the thrust can be taken and finally this is the frog what is the function of the frog is that 
the function of the frog is that it attach the sayer and the land side okay to a single unit or you can say the bolt it is bolted and that's why the name is known as the frog all the materials over you were seeing these are made of of your cast iron but your mb plow mold board is made of of your soft center steel okay so soft center steel i will take and tell you again in one of the video what is this soft center steel but the mb plow is made up of soft center steel okay the frog the land sides the sayer these are all chilled cast irons or cast iron the, the material were made up of cast iron okay and you can see if this is the standard to the standard the whole unit okay the so whole unit is known as the bottom so how many bottoms are there in this plow one bottom two bottom okay so these are the two bottoms of your hand plow right so first bottom and second bottom right so in the next video i will tell you how the what are the different parts of the sail and how the width of the plow can be measured thank you